This is Afternoon Sports Slay with the Queen, Micah K. Now, remember, I'm doing this for the love of the game, all right? And listen, if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe and like button. Now, I got an exclusive for you. We're doing a follow-up interview on the unified champion, soon to be, in my opinion, undisputed champion, Alicia Bumgarner. Make sure you tap in and check it out. So, I got to ask you, the people want to know, why are you not giving Michaela Mayer that rematch? It's not that I'm not giving her the rematch. Just right now, we are focused on the, the biggest thing, and that's becoming undisputed February 4th at the Garden. And, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm at the head now. So I make the decisions. I make the calls. And, you know, we want to see, everybody wants to see the undisputed fight. Absolutely. So I have to ask you, since you just brought up the undisputed, undisputed fight, as far as you know, you becoming unified champion, now you're on the road to undisputed. How do you feel? Do you feel like this is going to be your biggest challenge to date? You know, I, I take every fight as a challenge only because I'm a fighter. And when you step in the ring, it's a challenge. And again, this is an undisputed fight. My opponent is coming in, having a chance to become undisputed herself. So again, that I have to make sure that I'm on my A game and that we, we perform at the highest level. What's one thing that the supporters, you know, fans, and you know, you had the haters, you had the doubters and the naysayers, but what's one thing that you would want people to know that they might not know about you? One thing I want people to know is that we've been grinding baby for a long time. I started in this game since I was eight years old and my journey has just been a blessing and there's a story behind that. So when people know your story, they know who you are, they know what you've been through, they know where you come from and they just respect the hustle and, and your journey. Okay, absolutely. And I got to ask you another question, too, because I know you being a woman, being in such a male dominated field is so many things that comes with this, uh, you know, with that life that you're in, the pressure, the stress. I definitely wanted to know, too, who do you look to or any family or friends or mentors to give you that extra push or advice or help? You know, I have a great group of women that, you know, I surround myself with. It's, it's important to be in my feminine and not be in my masculine all the time because I'm in a male-dominated sport. I'm in the gym every day around guys. So I just switch that off and, like, just be in my feminine and just have a good support of women, my sisters, my friends, my gym class, um, the ladies that I train. So it, it feels good. Okay. Now I got to ask you because I saw this on Twitter. I wanted to ask you about the, um, I believe it's you doing juicing for the kids. I thought that was very key. I love working with kids. I am actually love reading to it. I do so many things working with the youth. So I wanted to ask you, you know, just you tell the fans a little bit about the business that you started right after COVID, I believe you said. Yeah, so it was during COVID. You know, I think it was something that I'm like, I need to pick something up. And because health is wealth and health is important to me as an athlete, it's also important for our kids to be, knowledgeable on healthy options and again being in the inner city we don't have those healthy options accessible and so juicing is one of those things where I'm able to do bring the juices to the gym have the kids drink those instead of sugary drinks pop and juice and, and have something natural and organic and something that's going to fuel them for their next workout. Absolutely. Thank you so much for your time, Alicia. You heard it here first. You already know what time it is, Slayers and Slayers. You see she bringing the juice on every level. In the Listen, inside the ring, outside the ring, you know what time it is. Tap in.